We were in the replay, and it's 1-0 Charleston Battery. And here you go, Martinez and Estrada. And Ant must have come out and punched that in. I'll tell you what, that's uh, one of the key breakdowns there is on this one. Feeling to the feet of Conway. Now laying it back, here's Anderson. Anderson floats across, looking for Jones, headed back, Cozier can't get there. Conway shoots and scores! Well, John Jones did not wait long to make an impact in this game. His first touch was an assist, and Paul Conway picks up his 12th goal of the year. And that looks like a brilliant substitution right there. Chris Ramsey has to feel like a genius right now. 2-0 Charleston. Long cross to the back post, and someone forgot to mark John Jones. A beautiful header across the goal. Very difficult angle. Paul Conway showed his goal-scoring touch right there. Again, another nice look. Jones hits it into Cozier. Cozier can't get on it, but look at the difficult angle for Conway to just slide the ball across the front of the goal, and that's a shooter's touch right there for the second one. The best teams defensively in terms of giving up goals during the regular season. It's not always the team that have the most points. You take a look at Seattle. Seattle can score goals at will. You've got to give them a lot of credit. But uh, it's not really the points and the goals. It's more or less the defending in the playoffs. In the box now, Diaz Arce attempting to turn. Pressuring Juarez, almost loses it. He does, shot, and a third goal. It's 3-0, to nil, Charleston. Wrap it up, folks. Jones. Huge substitution for the battery. Jones comes in with immediate assist, and he adds a goal to it. And again, you just had the feeling this was coming. Diaz Arce knocks it back. No one marking Jones and uh, hammers it inside. Turns around, jogs back for the celebration. Big impact he has made here in the second half. And Diaz Arce picks up the assist on a nice pass back. And now, believe it or not,